Welcome back to San Francisco, everybody, here at the Chase Center. I am Andrew Lopez, your Pelican sideline reporter on the Gulf Coast Sports and Entertainment Network. Getting ready for the first of two games against the Warriors tonight, I sat down with Pelican Center Daniel Tice to discuss the upcoming two games. Energy is going to be a big key tonight uh, against a team like this. How much is that going to be a focus and bringing that from the start tonight? We got to play all basketball. We got to hit first. Um, we gave up what, uh, 25 offensive rebounds. Going to say it's right now the team with the most second chance points. So I think we got to hit first and then play our best, but be physical and just rebound play fast. Even without Steph and without Anthony Melton, this is still a team that's going to get up and down and go up the court really, really quickly. What do you guys need to do to kind of stop them or kind of slow them down a little bit? I think their basketball don't change if somebody sits out. They have a system for, for a decade now. They're playing the same way. Um, I think it's more about us. Like after yeah. the last game, it's more about us. I'm playing physical, playing our basketball. And then obviously, you got to get down, score, get easy shots. So don't turn the ball over. Give them, give them the chance to run against us. There you have it, Pels fans. Got to bring the energy tonight. First of two. This one is on TNT. We'll be back tomorrow night on the Gulf Coast Sports and Entertainment Network. Thanks for watching.